Hi, today I'm going to explain to you the separating axis theorem, also known as SAT. The separating axis theorem is used to check whether or not two objects are colliding. For this explanation, I'm going to use two cubes. We want to check if cube 1 is colliding with cube 2. But how are we going to do that? We're first going to get a few axes based on the normals of the edges of the cubes. We're going to do this step by step, so we're starting with the axes of cube 1. These axes are displayed in lilac. As a quick note, SAT only gives accurate results if both shapes are convex. Then we'll need the positions of the corners. These will be displayed with red circles. Since the axes are vectors and the positions of the corners too, we can use the dot product to calculate the projection of the corners onto the axes. Then, by getting the lowest and the highest value on each axis, we can calculate the projection of the cube onto the axis. The projection of the cube will be displayed with a red bar. Then we're going, we're going to do the same with the other axis. Then we're not there yet. We also have to project the other cube onto the axis. Since we're using the corners, we can calculate the projection of rotated cubes too. In order to, for there to be collision, the projections of both cubes need to intersect on both axes, which, right now, is the case. But that's not right. You can clearly see that the cubes are not colliding, there's definitely room between them. In order to solve that, we have to do the same that we just did with the axes of the second cube. Since we already did the calculations, I'm going to do it fairly quickly. These axes are going to be displayed in green. Now you can see the two of the projections are not intersecting, which means that there's no collision. Thanks for watching.